Do you struggle coming up with ideas for blog posts or videos or just content in general to share with your tribe? If so, stay tuned because I'm going to share with you five tips on how you can come up with more content. Hi, y'all. I'm Carrie Shepard, and I'm a business strategist for women entrepreneurs, and I'm passionate about helping women build a profitable online business that fuels their life. So let's talk about content. Content is king. We have to be coming up with content really daily. You know, we think about it for Facebook updates, all social media updates, our blog posts, our videos. Now we've got live stream content we've got to come up with. And I hear so many of my clients asking me, how do I come up with the ideas for all of this content? So first tip is you need to survey or interview your tribe. Ask them, you know, what do they struggle with? What do they want to learn more about? Get it from the horse's mouth. You know, figure out what they're asking for. Tip number two is to research in Facebook groups. You want to go where your ideal clients are hanging out. So find Facebook groups that you can go into and pay attention. You know, what are people asking for advice on? What are they struggling with? You know, what comments are they making? You know, if you're an observer, you should be able to come with a, come up with a laundry list of ideas. And then tip number three is I want you to make a list of five areas that you enjoy teaching on or you enjoy speaking on. And then under each of those areas, I want you to start listing out different topics about that area. This is one of the best ways I've found to come up with content. And then tip number four is if you're struggling with content, what I found a great thing to do is to interview somebody else and give that interview to your audience. If you think about all the podcasts that are out there with interviews, they're not having to come up with new content every time they do a new podcast because they're interviewing somebody else and sharing their story. You can do this same thing on video, on blog posts. You could do written interviews. It's amazing. And your tribe will really enjoy it. And then last and final tip is give up behind the scenes. People want to see how you do things. So whether it's showing your tribe how you make your green smoothie, maybe it's how you do videos. I've done those before. You know, maybe it's a tour of your office. You know, it can seem really simple, but people want to get to know you. So that's a great thing for content. And then kind of a bonus tip is have a notebook or maybe um, I have a notebook and I have a file on my iPhone that when an idea strikes me, I can write it down straight away because those ideas don't last very long and we want to make sure we have this capsule of ideas so that we're not having to stress about coming up with an idea, you know, the day of when we want to do a live stream or the day of when we, run, when we want to write a blog post. So I hope you found these tips helpful. Let me know which one was most helpful for you and do you feel like it's going to help you with coming up with more content? As always, I really appreciate your shares. If you feel like this will make a difference for somebody else, make sure and hit that share button. Give me a like and leave me a comment. I want to know who is here and how I can help serve you in the future. I hope you have a beautiful and blessed day and go out there and create some content. Talk to y'all soon. Bye.